I've got a confession to make. I'm really only an ex-journalist. Oh, so you quit? I still do research, but I've stopped the whole writing part. Okay, but why? Long ago, I covered a story on a young girl, a ballerina, very talented. Lots of people were sure she'd make it big. I wrote an article about her because her story touched me. She was poor and had to take several part-time jobs while studying ballet. The article was a hit, and her popularity soared. It's the truth. Wow, that's really something. But at the same time, she suddenly had a lot of enemies. They must have been rivals, jealous of her newfound fame. After all the harassment, her family... What? I'm sorry. I'll tell the rest some other time. I don't think I've had enough to drink today. Go easy on the booze, okay? I drink and drink, but I can't get drunk. the recent chain of deaths. Just between you and me, it seems an acquaintance of one of our customers has passed away. This is a coincidence. Well, I don't believe in curses either. But to incur the grudge of a female is a horrifying thing. You see, my wife left me. When she was away on vacation, I brought a young lady home, just having a little fun. And then she comes home all of a sudden. After that, she's swinging all kinds of improvised weaponry at me. Phew, what a night. Uh, sorry to hear that. Yeah, but still, I love my wife even now. She's a classy lady. Hmm. Then maybe there's no reason for you to worry about the curse. I mean, if cheating is the cause of the curse, everything's already been taken care of, right? I see. You're right. <laughs> maybe that's why I don't have strange nightmares? Besides, it's just a rumor anyway. It's stupid. Well, the news will just move on once they figure out what's causing this. Owen, I am... She's pregnant, and here I am cheating for a third time. What am I doing? Hey. Hey. Are you alone today? Hey, uh, do I look like a good person? Yeah. You're not a good judge of character, are you? I'm one of the worst people ever. Huh? I sleep with lots of women, take their money, and run. Lather, rinse, repeat. Why? I don't like women. They disgust me. <sighs> what about you? Are you usually loyal to them? Well, I, I guess. I mean, I've been dating my girlfriend for a while now. So you mean you'd pull back even if the woman of your dreams hit on you? I don't know. Women don't stay true either. A happy family is just an illusion. Mothers and sons are just women and men when it comes down to it. Huh? Uh, just kidding. I'm going now. I only came to have one drink. Is that Rapunzel game any good? I tried it because Todd, my boss, was into it. It's a lot of pushing and pulling, just like relationships with women. Nothing but trouble. It's you. Sit. I've been waiting to speak alone with you. I can't believe you don't remember me. And all this time, I was striving to one-up you. One-up? What? I can change the markets with a nod of my head. I've got friends in every branch of government you can think of. I've done a complete 180 from when I was in grade school. So why do I feel so powerless? 
It's not like that. Maybe it wasn't to you. But I've been trying to surpass you all along. What? I don't think I'm that great of a person. In the end, there's not a single thing that I'm better at than you. I can't make the one person that I love happy. Oh. Anna, was it? Out of everything in my life, she's the one thing I ever chose for myself. But I have another fiancé. Uh... I don't know what to say. I don't need your pity. I'm not wrong. Excuse me. You guys are still just kids. Um How much does it cost to raise a child? After that rumor started, everyone seems to be a bit more tired than usual. Are the nightmares because of lack of sleep? Even if they were, they're all happening at once. Ah, uh, oh well, shucks, it's late. I'm tired today. I should go home and get some rest. I know this is sudden, but here's some trivia for you, as you seem to have finished your class. Did you know the United States outlawed alcohol between 1920 and 1933? It is said that this very prohibition paved a way for the cocktail culture to bloom. Alcohol made in secret tended to taste terrible, so people began mixing it with anything and everything to make it more enjoyable. These are the roots of the modern cocktail the more you stamp on a weed, the more it thrives. My, that's deep. And that was the cocktail trivia for tonight. Empty already? What would you like now? I'll try sake. Coming right up. All that alcohol is bad for your liver. <laughs> Hurry up! I've been looking forward to your trial. Did I, did I just hear something? Whew. Why do I keep cheating? Why can't I just tell her I have a girlfriend? Whew. I know this is sudden. But here is some trivia about Japanese sake, now that you've emptied your sake cup. Do you know who the first Westerner to drink Japanese sake was? According to records, it was Spanish missionary Francis Xavier, who came to Japan in 1549. In his letters written back home, he was amazed to learn that the alcohol was made from rice, not fruit. It must have been a rice surprise. And that was the trivia for tonight. Empty already? Are you all right? <sighs> this is our latest in the coverage of the mysterious weakening death epidemic. Matthew Miller was found dead today. We retraced his footsteps from the day before as part of our investigation. This epidemic, a horrible mess. 
According to his mother, who spoke with him on the phone, after that point, he'd been plagued with nightmares. Empty already? Are you all right? I'm fine. Whiskey. Coming right up. I don't want to let her down just because I was being stupid. Oof. Anyway, I can't turn back now. I can't let her find out. Oof. I know this is sudden, but here's some trivia about whiskey, now that you've emptied your glass. Have you ever heard of the term, angel's share? During the aging process, some whiskey will be lost to evaporation. This is called the angel's share. I hear that if they seal it so it doesn't evaporate, the whiskey doesn't have that nice aroma. What a fancy way of saying it. And that was the trivia for tonight. Empty already? Are you all right? You guys are still just... Wow, you don't look so hot. You should go home and get some rest. I know. Oh, yeah, about my bill. Uh... Yeah, put it on your tab, right? I know, I know. Anyway, just make sure you get home safely, okay? With all the rumors and bad news going around. Ah, you worry too much, Erica. I'll be fine. See you soon. Is it Vincent? We still need to meet my parents and tell them. Well, if she is pregnant, you gotta bite the bullet. <laughs> You've come. Tonight, we visit the Quadrangle. I didn't expect you to climb this high. Stepping on an ice block will make you slide until you reach the edge. It's a dangerous hazard that can lead to instant death. Be careful. Uh, snow? Shit, it's cold. Uh, I'm gonna freeze to death! 